I had an idea for a, uh, a Valentine's Day special thing, but that kind of fell through. Uh, <laughs> anyway, hello. It's been a couple days. Um, it's, it's, uh, yeah. Sorry about that. I think, I think it was just two days that I missed. Almost didn't do one today, but I, I figured, okay, I should do one. Two days ago, I didn't really have an excuse. I think that was Saturday. I just, like... No, no, it's just been going on. It's just been going on. Yesterday I maybe could have done something. I don't know. Yesterday was the fucking Super Bowl. That was that was fun. I watched the Super Bowl with my brother-in-law. Um, it was pretty good. It was like the first half was was pretty good. The second half until the end was kind of boring because they were just fucking punting the ball back and forth, like they. Neither of those teams could get past the the defense of the other team. They were just fucking like they literally just kept fucking punting it back and forth, and like it got pretty crazy at the end, though. It got it got really crazy because they were very close for a while. Bengals were in the lead, like all of the second half, I think, and then right at the end, the uh, the the Rams were able to score. And then the Bengals had like a minute and a half, and then and like I said again, they just couldn't get through the defense and just fucking and lost it, lost it, uh, lost the possession of the ball with only like 30 seconds left. So it's like, yeah. <laughs> um, honestly, because they were at like the 50 yard line or some shit, they should have they should have let McPherson kick it. McPherson's a fucking great kicker. He he could have he could have fucking kicked a field goal and tied it up, but they tried to go for it on a fourth and one. And it just didn't work because they just hadn't, like the whole game, they just hadn't been uh, uh, successful with like, ge like just generally they hadn't been very successful with fucking, whoops, with getting uh, getting yardage and getting points. It was a, it was a twenty three to twenty on the Super Bowl, so like, you know. <laughs> I don't know. I, I don't know. I, I think it was either that their offense was playing shitty or their defense was playing great. I mean, because uh, OBJ got injured, so, like, the Rams lost one of their best receivers. I think he's a receiver. I don't know a whole lot about the terminology. Um, the double's in the one. Okay. How, wait, how many of these do I need? I'll just make four. What was the... I need these things, so I'll make those as well. Um, anyway, yeah, because OBJ got injured, Odell Beckham Jr. Um, and he's he's a good player. Regardless of whatever his his um, position technically is, he's, he's a good player. So, like, the Rams losing him was, was bad for them. And I think there was also an injury on the on the Bengals' side. I know their quarterback had a bit of an injury, but he kept playing. I think both of their both of the quarterbacks had like some some minor injuries, but were able to kind of like push through. Um, and that could be partly why uh, neither of them were very successful in terms of like getting a lot of points on the board. It's a crazy game, though. I I'm not much of like a football analyst or whatever, so like don't don't take my word for gospel <laughs> in terms of like uh uh any analysis or whatever i i don't i don't fucking know i don't know a goddamn thing but um it was a it was a it was a pretty entertaining game to watch the commercials were great the halftime show was fucking great they had like a thing where you could you, you could download an app to watch the halftime show in like um in 360 but you push the button on the app, and it just opens up a Chrome browser. It just opens a tab on the Chrome browser. <laughs> it's like, why don't I need the app? I guess it sort of centralizes everything instead of, like, type in this exact website. It's just like, find the app, and then you can just find the app, and, you, and then you know you're going to the right place. And there was there was other things in the app, too, that I didn't really check out. Um, but it was kind of neat. I went in, I was looking at it for, like, a second. Um, but I, I, think, I think I preferred the, like... Uh, uh, production value that went into the looking at like the whole stage and like where they chose to put the camera because it was all it was all like choreographed and and where the camera was was part of that choreography so like uh, it was cool to pay attention to that instead of just like 
being on the stage and then not knowing where to look and where to turn the phone so that you see uh, whoever's performing. Um, I, I don't know. Uh, maybe maybe if I pay more attention to it like the whole time, I may have gotten a better experience. But uh, it was a good show. It was a it was a good it was a good show. All the all the performers. It was fucking. Um, Snoop Dogg, Dr. Dre, uh, Mary J. Belage, is that how you say it? And Eminem. Um, Eminem's intro was fucking great. <laughs> he fucking just like, he was just like in a box some the whole time, and he just started to rise, and some shit just like exploded and like broke apart outside of the box, and like, I think he came singing up, came up singing "Lose Yourself," um, which like of of course, obviously. Um, it's like one of, if not the biggest of his of his hits, uh, and it's a good song. So yeah, the halftime performance was great. Um, otherwise, the game. Okay, the game was the game was the game was pretty good. The game wasn't was. I don't know. I feel like the the with the the Rams and the uh, or not the Rams the the. Uh, the Chiefs versus Bengals, that game was crazy. And the one before that with the Chiefs, I forget I forget who it was, but that was fucking crazy too. Where they just, they kept scoring, like, they scored like 20 points in the final two minutes of the game or some shit. <laughs> um, I mean, and that's, that's I, I like that. That's fun. I like the high scoring games. I want to see a, a, an aggressive offense. A good defense is cool too it's just less visually entertaining unless you're like rooting for the team and you and you want to see you want to see them uh stop the other team from progressing but if both of the teams are stopping the the team if they're both like really good on defense then just nothing happens they just keep punting the ball back and forth <laughs> until they get lucky or whatever there was a, there was a couple there was a couple crazy interceptions and like clutch catches and shit so it's it was it was all in all it was a pretty good game Probably not the the best that I've I've seen. Um, yeah, I don't even know where I would try to like rank the the best football game that I that I have seen. Um, yeah, I got no idea. I don't. I haven't seen a whole lot of games. I've probably only like actively watched like a dozen like whole games. Um, a lot of my football knowledge comes from watching like highlights or videos about football or playing Madden. <laughs> so like, I'm not that into football. I'm just I've chosen it as the thing I'm going to talk about because yesterday was the big game. Um, wait, did did I say the name of it ever? I don't think you're allowed to say the name of it. <laughs> I don't know. I think that's only like commercially and and maybe this is a commercial work, but also it's not, it's not a big deal. I don't know. That's why a lot of people say the big game because the term, uh, the Super Bowl is is copyrighted or whatever or like trademarked or something. I think though, just like because I'm referring to it kind of journalistically, like I'm explaining that fact that the terms the Super Bowl is is. I think I can say it in that I'm explaining it. I just can't pretend to be affiliated with it or say anything about it that could be like misconstrued as like libel or something like i can't have a show where the super bowl happens in the show um and like it's like something anything just happens and then it's my then i'm implying some something could be happening at the super bowl or whatever but i can i can i'm pretty sure i can say the name a lot of companies like that just won't say it at all um unless they get the license to but yeah also, ah, fuck. I'll just, I'll just let it, I'll just let it play out. I know I said I'd stop using stamina. I did like accidentally use a bunch of stamina because it was one of these situations where it wanted me to do, um, a, uh, one of these maps or whatever to for, for uh, character quests, and I accidentally did thirty, uh, because I just clicked on the time trial and then I like. Without thinking, I clicked the max thing, and it, the max is 30. Luckily, the max is 30 and not, like, your max and, like, all that you're capable of doing. Because I could have done 90, but I accidentally used 30 and used, like, 100 stamina, um, which I don't want to be doing. I want to be saving up my stamina so that I just have a very big number, um, generally. Like I said, I'm still kind of using it in, this, in these instances, but, yeah. 
because I have I have stopped caring about seriously progressing in this game. Uh, I didn't even play the past two days. I didn't even open. It. I just like didn't because <laughs> I didn't do the video and I said <laughs> I don't know. I used to really enjoy this game. I don't know if the videos made it weird for me or if um or if I just naturally lost interest in the game. Um, maybe a combination of the two, but, um, oh, where am I going to put this fucking thing? My shit's such a mess right now. Yay. <laughs> um, ba -ba. Da -da -da -da. anyway, uh, Shh, wait. It's making shoes do here, so that's that's gonna do that. Oh, let me make a few more axes. That should be enough for the uh, the train. Uh, I'll I'll try to go back to doing these daily. No promises. <laughs> Shit's been weird. Um, but yeah, I I still got a few minutes left on this one. I I feel like I should try to make it longer, just because that's normally what I've been doing when I miss days. But I might not. I don't know. We'll we'll tr I'll try to maybe see if I can push it to like. Um, yeah, look at look at me, number three, all the way back here. And Artist Valley's got some shit figured out. Artist Valley's killing it. Um, so we're at, we're at the level seven dragon. That's crazy. Next time I'll try to participate more, and and you know if if I'm playing every day, I'll try I'll be participating more, and and maybe we'll get to level eight. Um, and even fucking, even fucking, uh, Birdium's been playing more than I am, than I have. Uh, because Birdium was, was second there. But fucking outclassed, outclassed by, by fucking, uh, Artist Valley. There's, there's a new, there's a new king in town, huh? <laughs> uh, no, I don't mind being third. Um, <laughs> is this... Is this gonna go well? I have a feeling this is the one where uh uh C C Queen C Princess or whatever is gonna die. Because normally she gets really low on health on at one point. Maybe not though, I don't know, maybe it'll be Nope, there it is. Okay. That would be that would be the point where normally she would get really low on health in like level one and level two. But now that we're on level seven, she dies. So I'm gonna swap out one of my um one of my things and replace it with the um, the revive again. 538 damage. God damn. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I wanna... Cause it, r cooldown reduction is cool. In uh, increased attack is also cool, of course. And we need the healing, that's, that's what's been keeping us alive. Um, but we'll replace this once again with uh would the shield be better than the heal hold on four seconds charge so 11 seconds to heal with an 18 second cooldown wait four seconds to start and then a 60 second cooldown for the shield and 70 percent or 17 percent of the max hp doesn't work on so many creatures this only heals the lowest hp hmm you know what? I'm gonna see what that does. I feel like I should like really workshop this and, and do the practice mode and see what what gets me the best results. But eh. Um. Let's see if uh, if this can can keep because I know um pure vanilla it has been has been healing. So like I don't know. The, the important thing here is that they all stay alive so that they can do their skills. Um, we haven't changed the amount of attack because we didn't take that one out. Uh, we haven't even changed how often they do their skills. So, like... A 60 second cooldown. No, 60 seconds is, is like, the amount of the fucking thing. It's gonna shield once. And then... And then that shield is just gone for the rest of the thing. There's no way that that that's gonna be the crux that that saves us here, because because he actually it's literally that the dragon does like a double move there and doesn't give um, pure vanilla enough time to heal. 
So like, I think what this tells us is that I should replace the, um, I should replace the pomegranate branch with the revive, whichever the fuck that one is. Feather? Yeah, that's funny, because it's like Phoenix Dawn. Um, yeah. Can I level up any of these? Um, probably not, but let's, let's see anyway. I kept just like deciding whether or not I even want to check, because like, probably not. Um, no. Very close to leveling this one, though. I uh, almost want to just spend all my shit on treasures. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> what if I fucking, what if I did that? What is it? Is this one? I could get 70. I could get 70. What, I mean, what else can I buy with these? Getting specific these is, is probably a good idea for some of these. Are, wait, are any of these cookies anyone that I actively use a bunch? This one might be good because I need her for a thing. I could get 42. I get 42 of any of them. Who do I who do I use though? Are they all here? Could level up Moon Rabbit Cookie maybe. What do I need for Moon Rabbit Cookie? Oops. Uh, I need 18. And then I think the next stage is is what um. Not 50, 30, 30, 40, 48. So I wouldn't have enough to do it twice. Um, but they're a very good defensive character. And I haven't been, I mean, I haven't been, I haven't been using them for the dragon, but still, they're a good, they're a good defensive character. Uh, huh. Maybe. Can I, I can, okay. No moon rabbit cookie here. What was I trying to do? I was looking at the, uh, I was looking at the, at the what? At the, the, the gotcha mileage shop. Yeah, moon rabbit cookie. Huh. Let's just do the 18. Say so fuck it, we'll, we'll promote We'll promote him once, because he is a good defensive character. Um, cool. What was the other thing I was gonna do? Uh, they're maxed. How much can I level you? Nice. Need more health stuff. I'm doing a lot of game, game talk right now. <laughs> game analysis stuff. Um, I'm not because we're past the 15 minute mark. This this video is boring now. Um, let's do this last guild battle. Let's see how it goes with the uh, the revive. So it's gonna it's gonna bring her back right at the end so that she can get more damage in. I think it's been doing like five something. Never fucking tells me, <laughs> or no, it doesn't. It, it doesn't have a history, does it? Oh wow, it tells you the skills. Interesting. What happens if I auto? No, I don't want to auto. I like this team. I think I think this team is effective. Wait, already cleared this difficulty level. Oh shit! Oh shit! Somebody did, somebody literally just killed the, the level seven. Okay. Um, who I wonder? Is it where does it, where's today's participants? Oh, Artist Valley. Nice. <laughs> cool. Okay. So we so we made it to level eight. I wasn't sure if they had if they had participated yet today. Um I don't think it was me that defeated that dragon, right? Because otherwise Yeah. It would probably tell me in the um in the thing too. We can check we can check and see. It'll it'll show up in the like history on the on the guild chat. Um I'm a little upset though because I could have I could have attacked again and then I could have got the extra bonus for killing it. But no, I, I don't care. Uh, okay, 
So on the level 8 dragon, <laughs> the Twizzly Gummy Cookie is the first to die. Um, I mean, I'm glad that the, the Twizzly Gummy Cookie gets, is the one that gets revived or whatever because she's also a very, very strong attack. So there's that double attack. And again, uh, Sea Fairy Cookie died, but Twizzly Gummy is still fine. So that's a good thing. Um, but yeah, the revive only happens once. Yeah, I, I, I guess there's really nothing else I can do about the uh, about the the composition and stuff. Cool though. Um, wait, I wanted to see that. Yeah, Artist Valley defeated. The young Princess Cookie's Rocking Jelly Dragon has been upgraded to level two. What the fuck does that mean? Training teaspoon. Oh, that's the okay. That's the um as one of the one of the uh uh the things. <laughs> anyway, it's this is enough video. Uh let me okay. Whew. Do, 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 do. Take care of yourself.